Hello, this is Kiss Baloo, and welcome to Level Up Time! In Let's Play Sword of Mana. Last time we went through this bastard of a place. And now we're hopefully. Oh yeah, now we're fighting Devious. I mean, come on, the statue is right there. Okie do. Oh hey, it's Bogard. I guess Devious did take him. But at least he. At least Devious can't turn him into a bird, probably. Hero, is everyone okay? Wait, was he Snake? No, I don't think he was Snake. I'm pretty sure Lord Grant was Snake. Whatever. Uh, well, define everyone. Yeah, she's dead. Also, we. None of the birds are actually any better, because we haven't fixed any of them. But you know they're not they're, they're they're not any worse than they were before. They're, they're they're still living, but well, they are also still birds. <laughs> yeah, hit the metal cage with your sword. That'll work. Uh, I'm sure it's because of the magic. I mean, you say that, but I'm sure he could break it if he wanted to without us, you know, killing him. What? What do you mean for abandoning Medusa? I understand if he wants payback for us killing Medusa. Unless he means you abandoned Medusa? Um. Um. Okay? Question mark? The fabric of society un- How does the fabric of society unwind f for the using mana power to save the lives of people? It's a good thing there's no music playing in this part right now, because that'll make that break really easy to sync. Anywho, um, where was I? Right. Logical fallacies, and and or a shoddy translation. Realistically, the one is related to the other. Well, anyway, would that really? You were wrong to not help her, or to hesitate in not helping her? Uh... The more I learn about this, the more I really dislike them, actually. Because, again, I can understand them being upset about their mother, but come the fuck on! She's one person! You cannot hold the you should just ah, the actions of one person this asshole and his choice to well mostly his choice presumably the other two warriors were in on it as well one of whom incidentally was their father probably just they're fucking idiots they're fucking so Centered idiots! But anyway, let's go talk to the head idiot, or at least his brother. So nice of you to come, you wretched human. You, he definitely was not this before, or this accent before. I don't care! Devious! You too are half human! If if Mavols work that way, it's not really clear. Now that my mother has passed on, I have no reason to stay in this world. Before I depart, I would like to clear up a certain matter. 
It is it the part where you try to kill me? It it's the part where you try to kill me. Okay then. You'll pay he didn't actually do anything to Amanda though. That was that was Medusa. What he didn't what he did to Amanda was not save her, which is sorta you know, you're you're being just as bad as him, actually. Um not the Dark Lord, because at least this asshole didn't persecute an entire people. You know. So that's some okay. Okay, the spinning platform I'm is not really I could do without it, frankly. Yeah, that's um seriously. How am I supposed to hit him? With great difficulty. Haha! You notice I'm not actually dealing that much damage. I wonder if uh, this would be more effective. I mean, not as long as I've been darkened, but. If that can just. You know, I better have an item that can get rid of that. Mmm. A lot of coins. Now that's interesting. But recovery. Physical effect. This'll probably yeah, that did it. Nope. Has to be the sword. I can't say I'm surprised. Ah! I don't care if you hit me. I have lots of wisp power remaining. Just don't, just don't hit me with the darkness again, please. Nope, nope, not, not that. Wisp. Yep, that's that's what I thought would happen. Oh, hey, it did wear off. Ha ha! Got you. Okay. Ah, uh, no, not mucking up with my controls. They're bad enough as it is. Oh well, as long as I keep on the edge, it's not like it's that big a deal, actually. It's because spinning! Which is really annoying. But I suppose to- oh, and he's dead. So, I don't understand how the snake lady produced a son who was, um... A half-human son, mind you, who was whatever the hell that was. I just don't. You know, I feel like I should just give up on the plot. Well, not the plot, actually. Give up on hoping for logical... Talking, dialogue, and all of the above. I mean, it's a common trope to leave him alive at the end, but... Oh, actually Devious explained it. No, because what he said actually made sense. It was a hell of a lot better an explanation than yours, that was, that's for sure. Devious, shall I end it for you? I bet it's Dark Lord. Please forgive these foolish humans. This is their idea of justice. To let you live with nothing but pain left. Then why not take your sword and grant his last wish? End his suffering. No, the, it's not Dark Lord. Who the hell's Julius? Or you could heal his wounds. I happen to have some elixir of life. 
I'll even let you have a sample. Well, okay then. And you'll decide your fate is to die. Hesitate not when you take up arms. If you have even an ounce of uncertainty, you have no right to raise your sword at all. With that resolve, you may one day wield the legendary mana sword. S the sword of mana, if you will. Is he dead? What an idiot. <laughs> oh, I know who this is! It's the guy possessing the vampire hunter. What the hell is that? Seriously, what the actual hell is that thing? A bitter age soul. Blending deep despair with profound suffering. Succulent. That's what I want to know! What is it? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> it's gone. And it seems it ate devious. And all of the birds that are still birds. In the end, it didn't even matter. We didn't even matter, because we're incompetent. <laughs> Some more than others. The anger and sadness of losing Amanda. It all exploded when I took revenge on DVS. But even then, my heart didn't feel lighter. Getting to understand what Seba meant. It's laughable to think a guy like me could ever use the Sword of Mana. Okay, since when was that actually a concern? I mean, I seriously want to know. Because the first time it came up, I'm pretty sure it was like five minutes ago. Anyway. Do you mind if I sing a song? For my sister. For Medusa, and for Devious as well. Ooh. Oh, birds flew off again. Time for another montage, I guess. Luster's haunting melody echoed through the town. Hearts are touched. Shown the town, air quotes. Even the hearts of the fallen are more moved. Aha! Music magic lets us pass. So I know where we're going next now. So you know that's something. The melody even reaches as far as Grant's castle. Oh hey, she's still with him. Actually, wasn't she picked up by Devious and not Dark Lord, or... I don't remember. I'm pretty sure she's the mobile, though.
Oh, hey, it's the maid. Mr. Hero, before you go... She's giving me a spirit. Lady Medusa had a special place in her heart for this spirit. I entrust it to you. Just take it. Just take it. Just take it! What she said. I'm Luna. That's because I'm a moon spirit, you know? Pleased to meet you. You know what? Lady Medusa had high hopes for you in the future. And you know what else? You can't live in the past. You gotta look ahead. That means you have to think ahead, too. If you're planning to step into the future, I'll go with you. Can't sit here mobile forever, can you? Luna the Moon Spirit! cha cha I'm sorry, but could you all leave me alone for a while so I can clear my thoughts? Go ahead to Castle Grants without me. I'll stay behind and wait for Sir Bogart as well. You and Lester go on. Grant's castle is past M Miasma Glen. Okie dokie. Try to keep that old bastard spirits up. Let's go, Lester, my boy. You do the singing, and I'll do the fighting. Mmm... Spirits. What does Luna do? Mugamorphosis! Mugamorph... Morphosis. Metamorphosis. Mugamorphosis. Somehow that's hard to say. Anywho, we're gonna stop up here. Join me next time when we go into the march. Until then, bye!